Hi guys, it's so John. Welcome back to the farm this evening. It's quarter to five, pretty much pitch black, but we've got rain coming all week. And uh, so we got out tonight and we were cleaning up pans, getting manure out. It's gonna be a muddy mess. I could sit and complain about that, but remember, we're doing things that we're thankful for. So I'm thankful that the family was out here to help. I'm thankful that these pigs got these pig loos where they can get in and stay dry. I'm thankful for the nursery. The piglets can stay dry and out of the cold. So you just gotta change your stinking thinking. So I do have a fence back here with these girls. I've gotta get a new battery on it. We have had lack of sun. So our solar chargers are going down. They last about three days without sun. Um, these guys are back in the woods, so I definitely want to make sure they have a charge on them. We're going to check out those sick piggies, what happened, what we gave them, and how they're doing. So hopefully you all can see me. We got enough light tonight. Let's get this fence changed first. So it's blinking red green, which means it's supposed to be at half charge. I'm at 8,000 volts there. So that is perfect for now. So these are a couple of mamas that we just weaned and a couple of our meat pigs back here. There's Chloe. I know it's a little fuzzy. I don't have night vision on my phone. So anyway, at least we can rest easy tonight knowing that they are good. If something comes up, it is going to get shocked. Let me grab this battery and uh, we're gonna head back over. Um, last video, you saw Marge's babies and one of them was breathing kind of hard and raspy. We have given it a little shot. We use like an LA 200. Can't remember the name of it actually. It's an uh, antibiotic. Um, it's this pig right here. I just wanted to show you guys so you can look for some things. You see how its sides are sinking in when it's breathing. And uh, so we had given it an antibiotic I'm walking into tree branches here um and we just want to show you how it's doing we also had some of our other piglets kind of get under the weather um once we took the mamas out and we wormed them we had some issues with diarrhea so i'm going to show you those guys at least we can get in the barn and get some light to see a little bit better and uh we'll see how they're doing and what we did Thankful for these lights in here in the nursery. Beginning of first week of December and uh, it is still nice out so we can't complain. A little bit chilly but let's not complain too much about that. So let's go check out Margie's litter first because that's the litter that had that pig that wasn't doing good. Okay perfect they're nursing. Let's go in here and check it out. Okay, so, hey, March, just coming to say hi, show everybody off. Here they are, this is the pig. You could, you remember, if you remember that video, its sides were really squeezing in when it was breathing. Um, it is doing so much better now. We did have the little runt, the all cream, it was actually almost turning ginger. Um, we did have that one get sick, and sometimes that happens with the runts, and, uh, you never like to do it, but we did end up putting the runt down. Um, you just don't like to see pigs suffer. And sometimes that's why they're runts. They're small and uh, don't do that well that often. So we made the decision to put the runt down. Didn't want it to suffer. Um, it's just part of farming. And so that's what we had to do. So she's got six left and they're all doing good. I'm super happy. This little little guy here on the bottom is doing much better. So we ended up doing an antibiotic and we did it for three consecutive days and it has really helped. So like I said in the previous video, when you see pneumonia or signs of it, you need to act quick because it can, it can take them out quick. Hey, March, you just waking up to say hi there. Let everybody know you're doing okay. So there's Margie's piglets. 
doing just fine. That's what we did for that little little guy there. And he is, he is really perked up. Here he is right here, this black dot on his head. So the rest of those piglets are doing good. Uh, might as well check out Delilah's piggies before we head over to the other ones since they're right next door here all these have done well like i said we've had so many boys it's been crazy this time around so you can see they're really filling out nice how are you doing how are you doing it's one of the little boys here's the other two boys up here under the heat lamp getting ready for some sleep tonight, which sounds like a good plan for me. Although I did just tell you it's only five o'clock, but man, when it gets dark like this, you never, uh, you get tired easy. So here's the little girl right here that Brooklyn reminded me that uh, that's the girl, not the one I told her. So Delilah's are doing good. So across the barn, we weaned the piglets, took the mamas out and then, uh, wormed them and we noticed these pigs getting diarrhea and it was a couple in each in each group so here's zelly's group and as it gets colder out this big space they start to use the bathroom in here so we've been cleaning this out here is peachy's group same thing they started using the bathroom in here so we've been cleaning this out at least they don't use it where they sleep they're kind of smart but they were having diarrhea here is Chloe's. We'll talk about Chloe's last. But so we ended up putting some grapefruit seed extract in their water. And we also gave them some pumpkin, just the canned pumpkin. We put that and mixed up their feed. And uh, they have been doing great. So speaking of pumpkin, we actually did put some real pumpkins in here as well. And they've they've been going to town on that. So a little bit of diarrhea. We used the grapefruit seed extract in the water and we used the canned pumpkin out in their feed. And uh, they have been clearing up and getting solid, solid poop. So that's a good thing. But uh, check out Peachy's group since we're here. We don't wanna leave anybody out. All right, here's Peachy's. They're already hunkered down here. You guys wanna say hi really quick? rear end hey girlies so they are they are doing better so you always get worried when you've got a couple of them with diarrhea and but we got that cleared up quick and last but not least we'll go down to chloe's we've had a ton of name suggestions for this white female that uh, we've decided to hold back here on the farm and i think i've come up with a name and uh, <laughs> I don't know if it's Jamie approved yet, but I think she might like it. But if I get the choice, 100%, my choice, here she is. And the two Barros, they're two brothers. These are the two females. Hey, can y'all say hi? I'm sorry, I know you were all hunkered down. The two brothers went to new homes, so we've just got the females left. But I'm thinking of calling her Betty, like Betty White. <laughs> so... I'm thinking that might be what it is. Hey, can you show everybody your cute face? Huh? Huh? Or you just want to sleep tonight? It's only five o'clock. I know. I get tired too. But I'm thinking Betty White for her. But anyway, that's what is going on here. We did want to talk to you about some of those things when they get sick, some of the remedies we've used, and it has worked very well. And like we said with piglets, you wanna act fast because they are small and weak and it can take them out fast. But everyone is looking on the men. They're fighting over a pumpkin in there. There's more of that outside, you know. Looks like they're heading out to get some pumpkin. But anyway, glad that they're all on the mend. We are gonna get them out of here. We're gonna get them out of here, clean these up. We use DE, diatomaceous earth, the food grade. We sprinkle that down once all the piglets leave, let this rest for a little bit. It'll kill anything that may be in here. But uh, that is our plan there. So we'll get these three rest in. We'll put these piglets together. We have one pigloo available. We have our pallet shelter. We may put them in, but that's what's going on with the piglets, guys. Wanted to get a quick video. Like I said, rain's coming all week. It may be hard to get a video after today. So hope you enjoyed this quick update. Hope you guys have a great week. 
you haven't already, check us out on Facebook and Instagram. And as always, make the change. We'll see you on the next video.